First things first, you can tell me your name, what unit you're with, and where you're from. I'm Lieutenant Tyler Schwartz. I'm with the 260th Engineer Company, uh, charge of 3rd Platoon. I'm originally from Missoula, Montana. What is going on here today? Uh, today we're building a road here uh, at the Orman Dam. Okay. Um, what is the purpose of this training? Um, so we're out here for our annual training, uh, basically get our operators more uh, time on the equipment and also do something uh, for the community as far as uh, building a better road for them to get to and from the recreational campsites. How often does your unit conduct training like this? Um, we get our two weeks uh, training once a year, um, so it's kind of a big culminating event. Um, and then we have our you know, uh, monthly drills as well. How does this training relate to deployment operations? Um, it's basically, it kind of sees what we're, our capabilities are. Um, you know, if they were, basically see how long it takes for us to get ready for them to, if they were to activate us. What is something you would like people to take away from this training? Uh, I just hope, you know, they take away, uh, you know, good experience as far as uh, getting to know the equipment, uh, building that team camaraderie too, because, you know, we're, we drill once a month, you know, we don't see each other like active duty soldiers, so when we're here together, you know, build that camaraderie. All right, sir, is there anything you would like to add? No, thank you. Good. So what is going on here today? All right, we're, we're uh, rebuilding a road um, today for the, to help out the local community for access to this lake. Have you ever taken part in Golden Coyote before? I have taken part in Golden Coyote uh, uh, a few years ago. We were down in the Rapid City area. So what is the purpose of your mission today? Our mission today is to uh, rebuild this road, put the culverts in for drainage uh, and gravel the surface so that when it's raining or you know then it doesn't the road isn't muddy so people can get in and out of here. What type of equipment will be used to complete this mission? The equipment we have here or the engineering equipment we have uh, the excavator or the um, scrapers which are hauling dirt to cover the culverts, the backhoe or the hymie. Uh, for digging the culverts in, replacing them. The graders, we are using them to level the surface and to build, also to spread the gravel on the finished product. How do you think this training improves soldier skills? I think the training improves the soldier skills on um, all their aspects of running, you know, the equipment and uh, for future if they need to, want to get a job with uh, you know, a, a construction crew or something like that, they'll have some experience with that. How does this mission affect the surrounding communities? I think the surrounding communities that are, that are coming in here to use this area for recreation, for fishing or just camping, um, with the road improvement that we've done, they'll be able to access it a, a lot better. They won't have problems getting in and out. Do you have anything you would like to add, Sergeant? Okay. You can tell me your name, who you work for, where you're from. My name's Todd Potter. I'm with the uh, Rapid City Field Office, Dakota Area's Office, the Bureau of Reclamation. Uh, we're out of Rapid City, South Dakota. Awesome. Uh, what are you doing here today? Uh, I'm just basically checking up and following up with these guys to see that the project's going smoothly and that everything's uh, everything that they need is, is here for them. Uh, what part did you play for this mission? Um, I was the, uh, myself and several others were uh, involved in the uh, initial topog and the design and uh, stakeout and layout of the, of the road. How do you feel about the guard's work out here so far? I'm really impressed. I, uh, we've worked with the guard for the last uh, oh, six, seven years and uh, we always get very good uh, work out of them and it's good experience for the operators but uh, I'm really impressed with uh, this year's operation. How do you think this uh, mission will impact the surrounding communities? I, the, the feel from the general public I think is, is really positive. Um, 
it does impact them for two weeks out of the year, but um, the product that they get in accessing camping sites all around the reservoir is phenomenal. Is there anything you would like to add, sir? Uh, no, I have no questions. All right, that's it then.